Occupational Skin Diseases, Wikipedia Article Audio Occupational skin diseases are ranked among the top five occupational diseases in many countries. Prevention Contact dermatitis due to irritation is inflammation of the skin which results from a contact with an irritant. It has been observed that this type of dermatitis does not require prior sensitization of the immune system. There have been studies to support that past or present atopic dermatitis is a risk factor for this type of dermatitis. Common irritants include detergents, acids, alkalis, oils, organic solvents, and reducing agents. The acute form of this dermatitis develops on exposure of the skin to a strong irritant or caustic chemical. This exposure can occur as a result of accident at a workplace. The irritant reaction starts to increase in its intensity within minutes to hours of exposure to the irritant and reaches its peak quickly. After the reaction has reached its peak level, it starts to heal. This process is known as decrescendo phenomenon. The most frequent potent irritants leading to this type of dermatitis are acids and alkaline solutions. The symptoms include redness and swelling of the skin along with the formation of blisters. The chronic form occurs as a result of repeated exposure of the skin to weak irritants over long periods of time. Clinical manifestations of the contact dermatitis are also modified by external factors such as environmental factors and predisposing characteristics of the individual. Another occupational skin disease is glove-related hand urticaria, believed to be caused by repeated wearing and removal of the gloves. It has been reported as an occupational problem among the healthcare workers. The reaction is caused by the latex or the nitrile present in the gloves. Prevention measures include avoidance of the irritant through its removal from the workplace or through technical shielding by the use of potent irritants in closed systems or automation, irritant replacement, or removal and personal protection of the workers.